And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And it's a quarter-final second leg battle in the UEFA Champions League. It's Porto up against Bayern Munich. Well, Derek, if Bayern perform as they did in the first leg, they will run away with this tie. But they need to concentrate, play with discipline and still work hard. starting lineup for Porto. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers, and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. the nod in goal. Lucas Hernandez plays with Matthijs de Ligt in central defence. Kingsley Coman plays with Leroy Zane in the wide areas. And the main forward will be the highly versatile Sadio Mane. Kimmich. Müller, in with a chance! There it is! The first goal of the game, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. Good value for it. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Who can he play it to? Opportunity! It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that! Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Threaded through by Miller. again and it's all about the pace in transition they're so quick to get out from the back and then what a finish from Mane he hits it so cleanly that's a top class goal from a top class player Tony Martinez and Porto regaining possession and he keeps going could be Come up with it. 
Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. And an effective clearance. Chupamoting. That's an effective cross. Aimed at the back post. And in it goes! The perfect header! Exactly what they were looking for. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, but just look at the space he has. He doesn't even have to jump. Of course it's a good finish, but the market is woeful. There's the final whistle, and the visitors move on. Well, I thought they were excellent over the two games. They controlled the midfield areas, they were clever around the box, and they looked dangerous in the wide areas. They were two really good performances. Well, he might be young, but he plays with a maturity beyond his years, Leroy Zane. What did you make of what he actually did out there on the pitch? Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable, and he inspires those around him.